Using the Compound Microscope Part A. Steps in Focusing Specimen Using the Compound Microscope Part B. Magnification Power of a Microscope Key Concepts Specimen A sample part of any material such as plant, animal, or even paper and mineral for examination under the microscope. Make sure to slice the sample thinly in order for light to pass through the specimen. Field of view The bright circle of light under the microscope. Do not use direct sunlight as a source to view a specimen because it can permanently damage the retina of the eyes. Magnification the ability to enlarge an image of the object's length in one direction but not changing the actual size. Part A. Steps in focusing specimen using the compound microscope. Step 1. Determine the specimen you are going to focus on. This can be a newspaper clipping or an onion skin. Step 2. Prepare a wet mount. 2.1. Cut out letter E from a newspaper clipping. 2.2. Place the cutout letter E in a glass slide. 2.3. Add a drop of water using a dropper or cotton ball. Then position the cover slip 45 degrees with one side touching the edge of the water and slowly lower the cover slip until it covers the specimen. 2.4 Tap the cover slip gently by an eraser end of a pencil until the bubbles move towards the cover slip's edges. Step 3 View a specimen 3.1 Place the glass slide containing the specimen on the stage directly above its center hole and set the stage clip in place. 3.2 Look through the eyepiece and adjust the mirror to find the field of view of the microscope. When the field of view is too bright, adjust the diaphragm. 3.3 while watching at the side, carefully lower the body tube by turning the course adjustment knob until the end of the LPO almost touches the cover slip. This action avoids breaking of the cover slip when starting to find the focus of the specimen. 3.4 Loop through the eyepiece again. Slowly turn the course or fine adjustment knob upward to raise the objective until the letter E appears. Continue adjusting until you can see clearly. This indicates that the specimen is in focus. Table 1 shows the direction of the specimen under the compound microscope. When looking at the microscope, the letter E appears inverted as seen below. When viewing a wet specimen such as sample of pond water or the like, use oil immersion objective in order to focus clearly the specimen. Part B. Magnification power of a microscope. The object's magnification can be computed by multiplying the magnification of the inscription in the eyepiece to the magnification inscription of the objective. To solve for the magnification of a specimen, you have to multiply the magnification of the eyepiece by the magnification of the objective.